Well, hello guys. This is Brandon back with Little NC Farmer. Coming to you today, y'all just seen me hoe my cabbage plants out there. I wanted to show you just a little bit about hoes. That hoe that you saw me using, that was, I call it just a regular old flat hoe. Uh, it's just flat across the bottom. I have a couple here. Now that's one of my dad's hoes. This is one my dad made me years ago. Uh, he found this somewhere, I guess. I don't remember where he found this at, but he took and welded it to a piece of pipe. And I've had this thing, gosh, guys, I don't know how many years. It's been down here. I've not brought it back home. But uh, I use it sometimes as just a little finger hoe. The correct name for this is called a potato digger. Well, we call it around here a tater digger. But uh, that's what this is. This is one I've had. I guess it goes back to the 80s, guys. I don't know. I've had that thing a long time. And like I say, I've left it down here. They use it. I have one at home that I use uh, primarily. But uh, this is one for down here. This is one that I actually made. Now, it was traditionally, it was just a, just a regular old hoe. Uh, I have no idea, guys, how old that this is. Uh, this handle and all, uh, this goes back, I was told that my great-grandmother actually used this hoe. And the original head on it broke off, and I made this as a furrowing hoe. I tapered it off down to a point like that and used it to actually make rows with. So... You know, and I just welded it on. Now, this is the original head or crook neck that was on there. It's kind of like a goose neck, I guess. Uh, I welded it on to this. Now, this is the original pipe handle, you say, and it, they bent it to a curve like that. Now, I was told that my great-grandmother used that hoe. Uh, whether she did or not, I do not know. Uh, but just thought I would pass that along and show you that little bit of information uh, <clears throat> probably going to do this in two separate videos but i'm seeing me hoe my cabbage out what i'm going to do now i'm going to take my tractor and plow the middle out with it so i'll do that in a separate video so anyway guys just thought i'd share this little tidbit of information with you y'all have a great day thank you guys from little nc farmer